Hey, my pretties, welcome back. So, um, it is early in the morning. I literally just came back home from taking Pooh Bear to school, and I'm sitting here and I, I feel ashamed of myself. I do. <laughs> I do you guys I had just literally posted a little picture in the community tab with um, my favorite person in the world Patty LaBelle and it was basically saying how does three plus two plus one add up to 230 something dollars I can't remember the numbers but man every time I go into Target I come out of there spending way more money than what I went in there to spend I mean, I think that is everybody's struggle. I know there's a lot of people that talk about that. What did I say in my post? I said there has to be something in the air because I'm telling you, I have a weakness for Target. Walmart as well, but Target is like, oh my goodness. Okay, so the reason for this video is um, I said, let me share some of my fall finds with you guys now. I have a lot of clothing pieces and I'm trying to figure out if I want to do everything in this video, like show you some of the decor. I have a few pieces behind me. I don't know if I want to show you guys the decor in this video and separate it and do some of the clothing in another video because I'm not looking forward to, um, I don't have my stand. So let me, I'm just holding the camera. Um, I'm not looking forward to really trying on clothes because it's just too much sometimes it's just too much but I was thinking maybe I'll just try on the tops or the sweaters and then show you guys like the pants and stuff so I don't have to do this whole big old thing um but yeah I wanted to share with you guys some of my fall finds so decor and clothing and with that being said I think I'm gonna just do everything in this one video but we're gonna make this kind of quick I don't have I don't want to have this long and draw it out and everything so yeah, I think, okay, so how we're about to do this, <laughs> I'm all over the place right now. How we are about to do this is I'm going to share with you guys some of the, um, the decor and then I have to run back out of the house. I have some stuff I got to do. Um, I'm actually volunteering today at Pooh Bear School. So I do have to go do that in about an, in about, what time is it? I have to go do that in about an hour. So I'm going to share with you, you know what, scratch that, scratch that. I'm going to come back. <laughs> I'm going to come back and then I'm going to show you guys my fall finds. Yeah, let's do that. But before I leave, one of my favorite things right now is, y'all, why did I just think that was a, a duck? It'd be ducks flying around here. I swear that looked like a duck across the street. I remember at the old house, I had ducks in the pool. I was like, please, like I didn't, y'all ain't paying rent here just in the pool swimming and stuff. So before I leave and come back, I wanted to share with you guys one of my favorite fall things. And I know you guys hear me talk about it all the time, all the time, which is my HelloFresh box. And you guys, it's been raining the past like couple days. And so I just, um, I just love my HelloFresh because sometimes I just don't want to go to the grocery store. I know I've said it over and over and over. I get tired of thinking about what I want to cook for dinner. Um, there's a lot of times that I'll just let my daughter cook because the, the everything is just so simple with HelloFresh. And um, yeah, I just, I have to express to you guys again that on rainy days, especially with fall and winter coming and you don't want to be running to the store, HelloFresh will save you, I promise. <laughs> um, so with that being said, I'm going to pop in a clip of my HelloFresh and a little bit of cooking. And then when I come back, we'll get into the haul and I'll show you some of the clothing items that I bought, even from Target, like some of the new, the new stuff. So, okay, you guys, enjoy this clip and I'll be right back. So this month's HelloFresh box showed up on a perfect rainy day. As usual, it included some delicious recipes that are sure to be a hit with my family. Um, HelloFresh saves me time and stress from thinking about what I may want to cook for dinner, especially since my days are usually pretty busy. So in this box, uh, I received the firecracker meatballs. That is definitely one of the cozier meals. Meat on top of rice with veggies, you can never go wrong with that. 
Um, I also received the Italian chicken and pepper sandals, which I love, and the bruschetta chicken, which I think that's what we're gonna go for tonight. So all of the meals come packaged in their own bag, so you never have any mix up or confusion um, about which meal is which. As you can see, everything is labeled and separated. Uh, which is definitely, it makes it really, really nice for kids. Like if your teenager is cooking or anything, that will help out. Make sure you check underneath the um, ice because all, all the ingredients come fresh and you don't want to forget about your meat underneath the ice packs down there. <laughs> okay, so we're going to hop right on into this meal. Uh, I want to get started with cooking. As you can see, I'm pulling everything out of the bag. Um, also, I want to let you know that you can easily customize your meals with Hello Custom by swapping proteins or sides, upgrading your choice proteins, or even adding um, protein to a veggie, a veggie meal. So you have the ability to, you know, swap out things if there's something in your box that you may not particularly like. So um, make sure you go to HelloFresh.com. Use my code Pretty and Flaw 65 for 65% off your HelloFresh plus free shipping. Um, you won't regret it. I absolutely rant and rave about HelloFresh. I have been for over a year and I just love it. So look at that. That is going to go on top of the chicken um, and I'm just preparing it. So the lemon, the salt, then I added some salt and some pepper to that, which I'm stirring around right here and I'm just preparing this meal the bacon that I'm going to cut up pretty soon is gonna go inside of the mashed potatoes that is the panko mixture with the cheese that goes on top of the chicken that I have already washed and put on a pan and so the meal um, literally took me like 20 minutes it was it was fast it was easy like I said it was a rainy day and we really really look at look at how gloomy my house looks like the, the yeah it's just gloomy and we love this so the bacon I was chopping up to put inside of the mashed potatoes and when I tell you the meal was a hit with the kids um, yeah we were very very happy with this one so I'm actually gonna take you guys to look outside in just a second <laughs> so you can see how much rain we had and Pooh Bear just absolutely loves it so again, if you guys are interested in checking out HelloFresh, which you've probably seen me do a few cooking meals, look at that. Um, like I said, go to HelloFresh.com, use my code PrettyAndFlaw65, my baby loves the rain, and that'll get you 65% off with HelloFresh plus free shipping. So we're going to go ahead and eat dinner, and this is what the end result looks like. I always try to make it look like the, 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 the recipe. I hope you enjoyed this. Bon appetit. <laughs> okay, item number one um, is my pillow. I think you guys knew that I was gonna pick this up. Welcome my pretties, I had to have that. I meant to grab it last year and I didn't. And when I went back to the store, you know this thing was gone. Couldn't find it anywhere else. Not Marshalls, Home Goods, nowhere. Um, it came from Marshalls, $16.99. So that's one of my first um, grabs for fall. Okay, I did purchase the Frankenstein pillow that you guys may have just seen me talk about or, or pick up inside of Ross. It was $10. I had to have it. Now, let me just tell you guys, I told you before, when I decorate, I do not like remove the stuff that was already there. I just kind of push it to the back and then I add the cute little pieces in the front. So what I mean is like, see, so when Halloween is over, I'll just move him and I'll still have my little decor back there. I do not be having time to be trying to remove everything and relocate it and stuff. I just kind of hide it in the background, just so you guys know. <laughs> And yes, I still have my tags and stuff on there because I was really just placing stuff to see if I was going to leave it there. But I'm doing the video, so I want to show you guys. Definitely needed that. I did pick up the other pillow as well. The one with the little eyes. It looks like little spooky eyes. So I picked that up and that's sitting in front of my little pineapple candle holder. Um, but unless I showed you all that, you guys, most people don't even pay attention to that. So... Don't pay attention to it. Okay, so then I did pick up two of the candy corn girls right here. 
definitely was going to get them. I thought they were so cute. My daughter pointed out, she was like, mom, I don't like her eyes. I'm like, why? <laughs> I thought it was super cute. So these came from Marshall's for $10 as well. So I picked up two of those. This candle, I want to say that was Target. That's Dollar Tree. This was actually from Dollar Tree. So I just kind of threw that right there. Still got the wrapper on it. I got, um, a couple more orange ones down there okay so then i was able to get my hands on two of the oogie boogie bowls the candy dishes from target um i absolutely love these and like i said i don't know if i'm gonna leave them here but that's where i just placed them at right now so two of those and those were i think they were 30 35 yeah 35 and they are the disney collection so two of those and then i got this cute little character right here which i think is adorable marshall's for 12.99 so from target i got the two pumpkins they light up these are five dollars thought those were cute not sure where i'm gonna put them I picked up another coffee bar sign. I have a different one over in my coffee area, which I think I want to switch out. So open daily. This was $3 at the dollar spot. And then this little cute thing that you can put your K-cups in was five from the dollar spot. And I already have like a, a carousel over there. But I purchased three, box, three boxes of these, which is my favorite, favorite, favorite. I probably will pick up a, a couple more because after they sell out, they are usually hard to get your hands on. Uh, the hot buttery rum, even at the ones that I was finding at World Market, they never restocked them. So I picked up three boxes of these, which I will put these only in this. And that's my little stash. Um, I also got this flavor. Not sure why. But I did. I just wanted to give it a try. Double chocolate. Oh my goodness. So the coffee will go in that. I grabbed me the double XL. Uh, I'm just now noticing I picked up the wrong thing. Oh my goodness. This is a double XL pajama set. And I swear I had the women's in my hand. This is the men's. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm going to have to take this back because a double XL and a men's is definitely going to be too big for me. And I was looking, trying to get the one, uh, the size for Pooh Bear as well. I guess I got to go online, but you guys get the picture. These pants were super duper cute. Wanted those. Um, yeah, I must have been moving too fast. Picked up the wrong thing. Okay, so moving on, I got these little uh, ducks for the bath i actually got these for pooh bear that one uh oh okay okay <laughs> don't pay me no mind um you got the little jack-o-lantern and then i grabbed a scarf from the dollar spot this one i think is really pretty they also have this in like a black and white so that I grabbed this pillow for Pooh Bear to put on his bed to go with his little Halloween decor that we're setting up. Um, and then my daughter was with me. She picked this pillow. She really liked it. She she convinced me. Um, this pillow was $10. And I do like that it's reversible. We only picked up one. Yeah. Not sure what couch it's going to go on because it really don't go with nothing in my house. She might even take it and put it in her room. I don't know. But my daughter picked this pillow. Okay, in this bag, I got the turkey cup from Spritz, $5. I also got the mummy cup because I am the mummy of the house. <laughs> I just thought that was cute. Got that. Another item my daughter picked was this little silly turkey. Um, she was like, I said, where are, we, where are we putting that at? She said, well, we can keep it on the counter. And I said, okay, well, I guess go get one. So she got us a little turkey. <laughs> I snagged the table runner, which is not going to go on my table. I think I'm going to do it on the um, kitchen island and then put some little decor on top of it uh, for fall. So that's what we got from the dollar spot. This was $5 and it's really long. 
I got this set of towels right here. So that one with the little pumpkins on the back. So you get two towels and these were five. And then the last two items was this little tray right here. I think that's super cute for five with the little spider webs on it. Look at me piling everything up like a mountain. And then this one right here, which I thought would be really, really cute um, to maybe put a candle on it, maybe put some uh, candies around it that's, you know, still wrapped like Jolly Ranchers or something, but a nice big candle in the middle with some candies around it or something like that. I'm not too sure what I'm going to do with these, but I thought they were cute. Okay, you guys, so now that I showed you guys some of the decor items that I picked up, which I absolutely forgot to tell you or bring down or show you, which I've showed you in a picture before, the Ulta Tree Hut um, Fall Scents. I mentioned it in a different video, but the ones that I showed you guys the picture of, the Pumpkin Spice Latte um, Body Scrub from Ulta, I'm not bit I'm not a big fan of pumpkin spice. However, it does smell really, really good. So I had to get it because it was a fall scent. And then that that coffee, what is it called? Velvet coffee or something like that. Favorite. I have to get another container before they sell out. I'll probably pick up two more because you know they're limited edition. Once they're gone, they're gone. But I absolutely love that coffee scent. Um, yeah. So I forgot to bring those and show you, but those are two of my other favorite. Uh, fall things right now. Okay, so as far as the clothing universal threads $25. I just got this little hoodie Um, And the inside looks like that so you got like kind of like two different colors and It's just your basic hoodie with the little rounded neckline Right there and I got that because I wanted these sweatpants which it goes it matches with perfectly um I'm not sure if, well, I mean, yeah, I guess it was supposed to be together. <laughs> um, yeah, so I got these and just some little sweatpants. I love the little rope in the front. Um, and the side has like this ribbed detail going down it. So right there, it's just a little different. And I just, I love the, when I picked it up, my daughter said, Mom, I don't know. I don't like the, um, she doesn't like the same color on top and bottom like how you'll have this on the bottom and this on the top. And what I was trying to make her understand, I said, well, you have to offset it by, you know, I'm giving, I'm schooling her in the clothing section. I'm like, you have to offset it with your purse or your jewelry or, and your shoes. So for me, I would do this and then I'd wear a certain color purse and then I'd match that with my shoes. So I was trying to tell her, cause I love me a solid print, like solid on top and on the bottom. I think it's cute. So these are definitely um, something that I had to have for the fall. Love me a nice jogging suit. Um, Universal Threads, 20, 20, were they both 25 a piece? 25 a piece. And whatever I um, am showing you guys, if I can, I always list it down below. And even though I do that, I still get comments that say, um, I can't find, I link everything down below. If it's not linked below, that meant I couldn't find it. Okay, so then the next item was from the men's section, which I love this color. Oh my goodness. It's, it's the original use brand, and this was a men, like I said, from the men's department. But this isn't just like a red red. It's like a cranberry red. I don't know how it's picking up on the camera, but it probably looks like a bright red on camera. But in person, it's more like a cranberry. And this is super cute. I used to love having me a little corduroy jacket. Um, uh, yeah, so I had to get this and it buttons down the front. I'll pair this of course with like a little white shirt underneath this, some light blue denim and some, maybe some white sneakers or something like that, or, you know, whatever you want to use it for. You can put this over a dress. It doesn't matter, but I had to get this and yeah, this was a large because it's in the men's. I had to, you know, go size down. So um, usually I would have picked up an XL in women's, but in men's it's a large and it was $30. Okay. So from the Kalana brand, um, I showed you guys all of her new stuff. Well, most of it, cause I heard that she has two more drops coming from what I hear. I could be wrong, but from what I'm understanding, she has two more drops coming. So I know a lot of people was looking for this one blazer that she had on. I think it was black with the green stripe down the arm. That's probably going to be in the future. It's probably coming. Um, but however, I picked up, um, I think four of her pieces. 
So I did get the blue and white like little striped shirt. I like it. Um, it's weird though because I wanted an extra large, but when I tried on the extra large, it was a little too big. It was like weirdly too big. And then so I went down to a large and the large fits perfect, but it was like too perfect. Like, I don't know. There was like no in between. So I just went ahead with the large. I think it's really, really pretty. $28 nicely made nice material and everything so yeah that's one of the first items I got of hers another one of her items was this dress the cute little black and white striped dress that I told you guys I was going to get um yeah so it has the little buttons down the side and the split at the bottom super cute love it um i really like the blue one too that she had but for me just something about the black and the white um yeah because you can you can dress this up or down you can wear it with heels or like for me i probably will wear it with a cute pair of white uh tennis shoes although to me this even though it looks white this is almost like a lightly cream like off-white i don't know it's not a bright white. That's what I'm trying to say. So, yeah, I'll probably pair this with a pair of tennis shoes. But this is a size medium. Again, the other ones was looking a little too big. So, I went with a medium because it is stretchy. And, yeah. This item was $45. Okay, so one of you guys in the comment section was like, they was mad, y'all mad at me. Because <laughs> y'all didn't want to be spending no more money but you had to have this green and white sweater or cardigan um from the collection as well and i'm i can't man this is super cute would you believe uh this is actually the second one that i had to buy it was 38 dollars. this is a size large when i first purchased this in my video i picked up a medium because it looked like it was it just the sizing just didn't look like i needed a large so i went with the medium um i didn't try it on in the store and when I got it home, it fit perfect, but I didn't like the way the buttons were but, uh, buttoned in the front. So I went ahead and gave the medium to my daughter because she loved it. She was like, ooh, why you didn't pick me up one? So this is my second purchase of this, um, and this one is a large. So I just like the green and white stripe. It is an off-white, like a tan, like cream color. Not tan, but cream color. Um, yeah, I don't know. I just really like that green. It kind of looks, give you preppy vibes, like, I don't know, like, yeah, I don't know, like preppy. <laughs> so, yeah, I went with the green and white. And, of course, I had to get this one. This one, I mean, and I was, and I seen it, and I didn't think I was going to want this. But, to be honest, a lot of you guys influenced me, because I follow the Target little page on Facebook, and, you know instagram you know i i'm easily influenced as well so i cannot lie you guys made me buy this one um because i wasn't really big on the cheetah print but i don't know after seeing a few people like put it together with outfits and stuff i really like the red and the white stripe on it so this is not going to be a piece that i probably grab out my closet too often but i just felt like it was something that i wanted to have and it's a size large and this was 38 dollars. i think it's cute it's, it, it grew on me once i brought it home and i stared at it a few for a while it kind of grew on me so yeah need i say more <laughs> i had to have this you guys i always wear like you know the vintage like style um t-shirts and stuff and i love old school stuff so fraggle rock definitely had to come with me um this was 15 dollars. okay so from knox rose for 38 dollars, and all of this was not purchased at the same time you guys it's kind of like a collective haul just wanted to let you know that um this is a knox rose jacket i think it's really really nice um and it's super soft uh and so yeah it has the two different kind of textures on it it's like kind of smooth and then this one is a little fuzzy and it kind of looks like it's inside out down the sleeve and i like the way the neckline lays kind of folded over like that and you have the buttons and everything and yeah just a cute little white jacket it has the buttons on the sleeve and yeah so i just grabbed it <laughs> okay this jacket came from walmart and i showed you guys this and i knew that i was going to get it because like i said i have some really cute little 
pink combat boots and another pair of pink tennis shoes that I could switch out with this if I wanted to. And I like this jacket. It's a double XL. And um, if you guys hear my dog, he back there breathing all hard. <laughs> Cause some other dogs just walked by. So he's in the door looking out the screen. He ready to bark, but he not gonna do it. Um, so yeah, I did pick up this jacket or a shacket, little shirt jacket. And I absolutely love the colors on that. And so yeah, how much was it? The tag isn't on here. I can't remember how much this was. Not right offhand. If I if I remember while I'm editing this, I'll put it on the screen. Okay, two more items, which again with the pink and the pink and black. This one came from Burlington, um, $25. Another shacket. But this one, I just absolutely love that the black is so dominant and the pink is just kind of thrown in there. So I think that is really, really cute love that one and that's an extra large and this came from tj maxx for 35 because i am a sucker for cardigans and jackets and sweaters and stuff like that um because whenever i'm able to wear them in california it just seemed like it don't really get too too cold enough to always have like really big jackets but that's why i kind of gravitate more towards um the cardigans the shackets will probably be something that i wear like in the evening time or at night once it's a little bit colder but through the day i love to be able to put on a really cute little sweater or a cardigan and i love the detail on this one there's the belt and yeah the material is really nice and it was 35 i told you by sioni um yeah really pretty okay so then the last couple things from the dollar spot um one two is from the dollar spot and then one is a purse um from target was i did grab these cute little bundles of socks for three dollars from the dollar spot and you get the cheetah print you get the ones with the flowers on it i mean um plants and then this one with the little mushrooms on it mushrooms are everywhere this season <laughs> mushrooms and gnomes and then this one is the little peppers peppers and hot sauce right there and my favorite is the little turkeys super cute love that and then this one has just the little stripes on it and the last thing that i picked up which i just had to have because the color is so pretty even though it's a little too small for me um i just think this is so pretty love love that color love it um burgundy oh my goodness this was like i remember when i first started wearing makeup when i very and i was late in the game you guys i probably was like when i first bought my first lipstick it came from mac and i probably was about 27 years old yes 27 26 or 27 because i remember going to the mall to the mac counter and what was the color it was it was this color that i bought and i bought a lip liner to match it was Verusha, Veruca, Veruca. I think that was the name of it. If you're an old Mac girl, then you know Vino was the lip liner and Verushka or something like that was the lipstick, but it was this color. So this was like my first color lipstick that I ever owned. And boy, was it, it was bold, but I got used to wearing it. Um, before that, all I did was the same as I do now is wear lip gloss. That's my thing. So, um, but yeah, I don't know why I just went into that story, but I had to have this little purse, little crossbody, and it has a little adjustable strap. It's big enough for me. I put my wallet in here. It was big enough for my wallet and um, a couple little things, my phone and stuff like that, my keys. So if I'm just running out or something, I'll just throw this on, but I love it. And it was $30. So that's it, you guys, for my fall haul. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Like I said, I will try to link anything that I have down below and as well as the information on hellofresh that will be down below as well don't forget to use my discount code um and yeah so what else did i want to tell you guys i think that's it for right now with that being said i thank you for watching don't forget to hit that subscribe button um 
yeah, I'm looking at all my stuff in the background. Like I gotta figure out where I'm gonna put everything at. I don't do too much decorating, but I wanted to add a couple pieces here and there. So yeah, but thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. You like my little chibi girl over here? My daughter made that for me. She's so cute. She's supposed to be me carrying a little hand basket. Look at her. She's so cute. Okay, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll talk to you guys real soon in my next video. Okay, bye you guys.